Founded in August 1982, the Teachers Club is today celebrating its Silver Jubilee. It all started 25 years ago when a group of primary school teachers led by Mr. Papayanaidu realized the importance of leisure in the life of people. Their aim was also to bring about primary school teachers to develop a spirit of camaraderie and solidarity. And this movement ultimately gave birth to the Teachers Club on the 17th August 1982. And we can proudly say that the Teachers Club is an impressive achievement. Ce Teachers Club a été créé avec une centaine de membres et pendant les quatre premières années, euh, j'ai voulu moi-même donner une certaine orientation. Euh, les activités qu'on pensait pouvoir euh, donner au Teachers Club, c'est d'abord le sport et aussi le développement culturel, c'est-à-dire le drama, théâtre et autres activités qui pourraient créer un lien de famille parmi les enseignants. Et je suis très content après 25 ans de constater que cette initiative a, a pris un élan intéressant vu qu'il compte actuellement 1200 membres et euh, d'autres activités sont organisées. During these last 25 years, the club has been involved in many activities. We have even organized seminars and forums to debate on hot issues in education. We also pondered on the future of our profession. Teachers' Day is not only a celebration, but it is also a call for action. It is a reflection on our profession, on its destiny. The Teachers' Club is also an important platform of cultural expression and socialization. Teachers and their kins participated in concerts and some years back in different episodes of Prof Gentimec, a hilarious drama written by the much appreciated Jan Obiluk and staged by the Teachers Club. Depuis notre arrivée au Teachers Club, nous avons organisé plusieurs activités sportives, telles des tournois de foot, de volley, des indoor games. Nous avons aussi participé dans des tournois organisés par d'autres organisations. Il y a eu des hauts et des bas, mais nous avons aussi savouré des victoires. En 1996, nous avons remporté la médaille d'or au tournoi de foot organisé par le Public Officers Welfare Council. L'année suivante, en 1997, nous avons enlevé la médaille d'or, mais cette fois-ci dans un tournoi de foot organisé par le Prisons Officers Welfare Council. Mais ce qui nous a fait le plus grand plaisir, c'est le cadeau que nous a offert notre équipe de foot en remportant le championnat de foot pour la deuxième fois, car cette année-là, nous célébrons le 25e anniversaire de notre club. Vive le Teachers Club! During the past 25 years, the Teachers Club has organized innumerable outings throughout Mauritius and Rodrigues. Despite that most of the programs being of low budget at start, teachers and their families have been able to set foot on places they never dreamt they would be able to visit. Our outings have enabled teachers to meet long lost friends and to make new ones. Some of our outings have an educational aspect, such as our visit to Ile Zegret, recently proclaimed Natural Reserve, where teachers have discovered the attempt to preserve and reconstitute the flora and fauna which once proliferated on the coastal regions of Mauritius. Ile Zegret is now the breeding ground of Le Pigeon des Mars, also known as the Pink Pigeon, which was once on the verge of extinction. 
We also found a rich variety of indigenous plants, among which the ebony trees, which was so coveted and profitable to the Dutch. Some of these programs have eluded us from our daily strenuous routine and troubles, whereby we felt relaxed and peaceful while strong. was there to nature. meet us. Welcome, sign to greet us. Ten porters stood up like a wall. Le yeah, domaine du chasseur, at the very heart of the Campo range, is one of these magical places where teachers and their families discovered the beautiful scenery of our native forest, which conveyed a feeling of tranquility and harmony. As years went by, new generations of teachers joined the teachers' club. They brought in new ideas and our programs became more sophisticated and eventually more ambitious. Thus, in 2004, on the celebration of our 20th anniversary, more than 100 teachers, accompanied by their families, boarded the Mauritius Pride for an unforgettable cruise on the North Islands of Mauritius. This voyage became such a success that we had to organize additional cruises the following year. Inquisitiveness for more breathtaking sightseeing has led the Teachers Club to another flourishing achievement, which is obviously our voyages to foreign parts of the world, like Dubai, India, Malaysia and Singapore, which have undoubtedly left our members and their families with immense satisfaction, unforgettable memories and yearning for more. The club has known great leaders, starting with Mr. Papayanaidu, the founder himself, and the several others that later followed. However, there is somehow one that deserves mentioning. He is Ashik Jungli, our actual president, who has been very active since he joined the club some 20 years back. In fact, it is under his leadership that the club gained its titre de noblesse. Et le club, c'est une havre de paix. C'est un, une plateforme par excellence pour que les enseignants se rencontrent en famille, entre amis, pour qu'ils puissent partager leur expérience, leur vécu. Durant ces 25 dernières années, le Teachers Club n'a pas chômé. Le Teachers Club, je peux dire, a connu un succès phénoménal. Non seulement en termes de membership, mais aussi au niveau des activités. Nous avons organisé toute une panoplie d'activités pour satisfaire les besoins, les intérêts des uns et des autres. Sans compter les diverses activités sportives, littéraires, sociales que nous organisons tout au long de l'année afin de permettre aux enseignants de se socialiser, et de rencontrer leurs amis et cela dans un environnement sain et dans une ambiance de franche camaraderie. Nous, au niveau du club, nous avons une philosophie très déterminé, c'est cimenter les relations qui existent entre tous les membres, c'est aider les enseignants, promouvoir les enseignants à mener une vie sociale très équilibrée. Such tremendous work originated from our sense of duty, our commitment to work and our ability to deliver. This enabled us 
to meet our objectives. We are also very thankful to our faithful members and it is only with their support and trust that we are stepping in for future challenges with lots of serenity. Could fit more perfectly than to have a world party on the day.